want to do like a my face in the middle. Can you just face in the middle there? Ba 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 ba. Today I'm at Brandon and Tasha's house. Excited to be here. They're two YouTube superstars. Brandon to Garbage Disposal Clark channel and the Hayashi channel. See the links in the description below. We are in Mississippi right now. And we went out to a local grocery store which is called Kroger's. I don't have a Kroger's in Pennsylvania. But I was excited to see they have all kinds of specialty kettle cooked potato chips. I'm not a big fan of, of kettle cooked chips. I usually like the regular chips, but these flavors are incredible. So I have a Cuban style sandwich and jalapeno. What do you got, Brandon? I got the Reuben and the cheeseburger. So how can you go wrong with these names? You got to give them a try. They're actually only $1.49 a bag, eight ounces to the bag. So we're just going to open these up see what we think about these you want, you want to start with that and go with cheeseburger i don't know what to start with i'm like uh we'll start with the, let's go got, with cheeseburger you want to go with cheeseburger that's not regular that's backyard cheese backyard cheeseburger okay all right let's open these up okay Kind of smells like a hamburger. What do you think? I smell a little deep. I don't know. At first, it smelled like a barbecue. What do you, what do you have all over your hands by that big rock of a ring? Oh, I thought you were talking about the ring. Is this, that is that the Jackson uh, Wing Bowl Championship ring? This actually, I'm in Mississippi, so but uh, it's Memphis oh. Wing Champ. I'm the Memphis Wing Champ. Oh, congratulations! But I did show them how to eat wings in Jackson, Mississippi. That as is well. a heck of a ring you got there. Uh, I tried. Look at yours. Do you got I don't one? even. I don't even have my ring on. He's used to it. I'm just, gonna have to call time out on this. You know, I was just kidding. I'm always got the got the rings on. So let's see. Let's do a little side by side here. Look at that thing. I can't think. There's a cartoon that they do something. The Memphis Wind Bowl apparently is, is a lot Care bigger, Bears. A lot bigger Wind Bowl. Wonder powers activate. Wonder Twin powers activate. Wonder Twin powers activate. Yeah. I don't Shape think of a uh, food review <laughs> critic. Okay. All right. I think this was my chip before I had to run back to get my ring. Yeah. Did you try your jersey yet? Did you wait? I'm like, I don't want to lie. Oh, he did. Yeah. He tried it while I was getting the ring. Oh, I, I, I told him, um, you're, you shut it off. I said, I got to pretend like I didn't have it, but I don't want to lie. It's Wednesday. I don't oh, lie on Wednesday. That's right. Yeah. Ready? All right, here we go. I'm getting a pickle. I, I'm going to say it tastes like dill pickle to me. Dill, you're getting more dill pickle than anything. I'll taste like... It's not bad, but it, I don't get that. It's more dill. They put too much dill, I think, in it. But that's the kettle corn. The kettle, I mean, the kettle cooked. It's You can't get to the flavor yet. After you, you got to get to the crunch first. Your brain's like, man, this right. is crunchy. So you don't get to the, the flavor until that's... I still get a depth of something a little bit, but that dill is uh, overpowering. I mean, it's it's very bad. crunchy, which I love. I love the salt. I love the crunch. Like, top grade for that. But it does just, to me, taste like a dill-flavored potato chip. My problem with the kettle cook is, to me, it's usually too greasy. Yeah, it's not greasy. It's crunchy. It's not, it's not greasy. No, these aren't greasy at all. So, that is good. <laughs> the Reuben. I almost got something that tasted about like it was uh, the... Uh, Sauerkraut, but then it just went away. I was gonna say if we did this on a blind taste test, which Pickles. we probably <laughs> we probably could have, I wouldn't be able to guess these. These aren't obvious. These are mostly pickle again. I don't. It's not near as strong as pickles. Uh, I'm not getting that. I like the aftertaste. That after the the strong like pickle kind of taste. I was thinking I was getting a sauerkraut, and then it just went. It, There's, it's almost like the flavor, something flavor is hitting you, and then it disappears. But the aftertaste, like after you're done eating it, I think tastes better than the, the cheeseburger one. But I, I'm really, really not getting a lot of flavor. I'm barely getting a sense of flavor on this at all. But it's still a great chip. I really think these chips are a For dollar fifty too. Yeah. Dollar forty now. These are really good potato chips. We have the Cuban style sandwich. No, that is. I don't know. There's a smell, but I can't. Well, 
Well, they definitely taste different than each other. They taste. They taste. I like this one so far. Right? I was still getting a little pickle, though. I don't know if it's just in my head from the first one. I'm still... But it's good. I mean, I barely taste a pickle in this one like a pickle. No, it's... This, oh. to me, is the most consistent. It has the, the initial it has taste. has a lot of stuff going on. And the aftertaste. Like, there's other two are just like a one-way chips. They're either get up front or at the end. I like this one. I'm going to say this is my favorite. Put another big crunch in. Hopefully it tastes at least like a jalapeno, but I'm, I'm holding out for spice. Cause I want a spicy potato chip. If you guys know of a spicy potato chip, a real spicy potato chip, let me know in the comments below because I want to have it. These definitely have uh, what looks like flavor on here. The other ones were, were more plain. Yeah, that's that deserves a definite. Let's see. This one is darker, so I'm thinking this might have some more flavor. You ready? Okay. No. Where's the jalapeno? This is bland. There is, there is definitely. There's, there's, no, no, there's nothing. It's I, like got, nothing. I got a little bit of spice now. Where? Not much. Not much. <laughs> It's the most bland right from the start, but I do, weird. there's a little tingle there, but it's, I mean, not spicy in, by any stretch of the imagination. It's like, this looks the best, like it's going to be packed full of flavor, but there's like nothing. It's like, it's weird. It's nothing until right at the end when it's gone and then you, you get a tingle and a deep, deep spice. It's like it's weird. It's not. A dollar forty nine for this size bag of chips, definitely worth it. But it's, if you're looking for any flavor of any of these, at least, they do have some other varieties that, that they were out of at the store we were in. I would go with Cuban Sandwich, and so would the Disposal. And he's yeah. a professional. Yeah. That's I think, what they say. I think we're going to have to we get Hey Oshi to, to verify. But, it smells like pickles. It smells like pickles. Yeah. I told you all of them. They, they, they all kind of smell like pickles. That's the That's Cuban? The I've never had a Cuban Sandwich. Okay. Okay. But that's a lot of flavor. That's the jalapeno. <clears throat> it's a little spice. The next one, but... So this is the Reuben. It don't taste like anything. Really. Right? In the beginning, there's nothing. It's just... like it smells like it got a lot of flavor, but yeah. then you eat Boy, it and it's nothing. I'm glad all three of us are on the same page so far. So this is the backyard pickle chip. But they spell pickle just like you spell cheeseburger. Thank you very much. I didn't mean to put you on the spot. Oh, you good. He do it all the time. Yep. Her name's Tasha. <laughs> Her name's Tasha. It's Tasha. Yeah, it's hey. I K say hey. Yeah. channel. Again, see her link in the description below. See Brandon's link in the description below. And I want to thank them for letting me film at the Disposal Castle. Or what, what is this called? That's the best, disposal best studio. I heard so far. <laughs> well, thanks for coming to another video. And I'll see you guys again soon.